Good day, aspiring engineers. In this video, I'm going to show you how to import a CAD file into Fusion 360. Recently, I showed you how to download a file from GrabCAD. We'll use those. Stick around. This is the second intermediate tutorial after the 16 basic tutorials. If you haven't done those 16 basic tutorials, I recommend you start there. There's a link in the description below. Let's do the SOLIDWORKS example first. Do you remember that we downloaded a Geneva mechanism last time in the SOLIDWORKS format and we also downloaded another one in the industry standard STEP file format? Let's do both of those beginning with the SOLIDWORKS example first. In Fusion 360, click on New Project and give it a name. Double click on the new project and click on the upload button. Here we can select the files, uh, we can mess around, but it says drag and drop, so that's what we'll do. I've just selected all four of the files in my file manager and I'll just drag them all over and drop them into the upload dialog and click upload and up they go. Close the dialog, double click on your project. And there it is, comes in very nicely. Now it does come in very nicely if you've got the education license or the commercial license or the startup license. And you can tell what sort of license you have by looking up here in the top left corner and you can see that I have the education license. Whatever yours will be is there. If you have the personal use license, then you won't be able to import SolidWorks files, but you can do industry standard formats like the STEP file. Let's do that one next. Going back to the home of the data panel, click on New Project, give this one a name, Geneva Mechanism Step, that'll do. And for this one, we'll click on the Upload button. And there it is. Just one file in this case, Geneva Mechanism, and you notice that the file extension is .stp. Click Upload. Double click on the project. And here it is. This one's a little bit different. We can do something with that. So next time we're going to modify these mechanisms in Fusion 360. See you then.